ವಂದೆ ಗುರುಪದ್ವಂದ ಭಕ್ತವಿಂದ ಸಮನ್ವಿತ ಶ್ರೀಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ವಂದೆ ನಿತ್ಯಾನಂದಸಹೋದಿತ ಶ್ರೀನಂದನಂದನ ವಂದೆ ರಾಧಿಕಾಚರಣೋದಯ ಗೋಪೀಜನ ಸಮಯುಕ್ತ ಬಿಂದವನ ಮನೋಹರ ವಾಂಶಾಕಲ್ಪತರುವಶಿಪಾಸಿಂಧುವ್ಯವಚ ಪತಿ ಪಾವನೆಭ್ಯ ವೈಷ್ಣವೇಭ್ಯೋ ನಮೋ ನಮ ಮೂಕಂ ಕರೋತಿ ವಾಚಾಲಂಗ್ ಪಂಗೂಂ ಲಂಘಯತಿ ಗಿರಿ ಜತಿ ಪಾತಮಹಂಗ ಬಂದೆ ಪರಮಾನಂದಮಾಧವ ಬೃಂದಾವೈ ತುಳಸಿ ದೇವೈ ಪ್ರಿಯಾ ವೈ ಕೇಶವಸ್ಚ ವಿಷ್ಣಭಕ್ತಿ ಪದೇ ದೇವಿ ಸ್ವತ್ವತ್ವೈ ನಮೋ ನಮಃ ನಾರಾಯಣ ನಮಸ್ಕೃತ ನರುಂಚಮ ದೇವಿ ಸರಸ್ವತಿ ವ್ಯಾಸ ತೋ ಜಯೋ ಮುದೀರ ಸಂಕೀರ್ತನೆ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಕಥೋಪದೇಶ ಗೌರೀಯ ಪಾತ್ರಶ ಪ್ರಕಾಶನೆ ಸದಾನುರಕ್ತ ಗುರುಭಕ್ತಿಯುಕ್ತ ಭಕ್ತಿ ಪ್ರಮದಾಕ್ಷ ಜಗೋದ್ಬರು ಧೈಯ ಸದಾ ಪರಿಭವನ್ನು ಮಭಿಷ್ಟೂಹಂ ತೀರ್ಥಾಸ್ಪದ ಶಿವ ವಿರಿಂಚನು ತಂ ಶರಣ್ಯ ವೇತಾತ್ಯುಹಂ ಪುನಥಪಾಲ್ಯಭವಾದಿಪೂತ ವಂದೇ ಮಹಾಪುರುಷತೆ ಚರುಣಾರವಿಂದ ಜತ್ಪಾದಪಲ್ಲವನ ಖಚಂದಮನಿ ಛಟಾಯ ವಿಸ್ಫುರಜೀತ ಕಿಮಿ ಗೋಮಧೂಸ್ವದರ್ಶ ಪೂರ್ಣಾನುರಾಗ್ರ ಸಾಗರ ಸಾರಮೂರ್ತಿ ಸಾರಾಧಿ ಕಾಮಯಿ ಕದಾಕರು ಶ್ರೀಕೃಷ್ಣ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ನಿತ್ಯಾನಂದ ಶ್ರೀಅದ್ವೈತ ಗದಾಧರ ಶಿವಸದಿ ಗೌರಭಕ್ತವಿಂದ ಶ್ರೀಕೃಷ್ಣ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ನಿತ್ಯಾನಂದ ಶ್ರೀಅದ್ವೈತಗದಾಧರ ಶಿವ ಸದಿ ಗೌರಭಕ್ತವಿಂದ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ಅಜಾನುಲಂಬಿತ ಭುಜೌ ಕನಕಾಬುದಾತು ಸಂಕೀರ್ತನೈ ಕವಿತರೌ ಕಮಲಾಕ್ಷ ವಿಶಾಂಬರೌ ದ್ವಿಜವರೌ ಜುಗಧರ್ಮಪಾಲೌ ವಂದೇ ಜಗತ್ಪ್ರಿಯಕರು ಕರುಣಾಭತಾರು ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ ಹರಿ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ನಮಿ ಗಂಗೆ ತವ ಪಾದ ಪಂಕಜ ಸುರಾಸುರೈರ್ವಂದ ದಿವ್ಯರೂಪ ಮುಕ್ತಿ ಮುಕ್ತಿ ದಿ ನಿತ್ಯ ಭಾವಾನುಪೇಣ ಸದಾ ನರಾನ ಗಂಗಾತರಂಗರಮಣೀಯ ಜಟಾಕಲಾಪ ಗೌರೀ ನಿರಂತರ ವಿಭುಷಿ ತ್ವಾಮ ಭಾಗ ನಾರಾಯಣ ಪ್ರಿಯ ಮನಂಗು ಮದಾಪಹಾರ ವಾರಾಣಸಿ ಪುರಪತಿ ಭಜ ವೀಶ್ವನಾಥ ವಾಗೀಶಜುಷ್ವದನೆ ಲಕ್ಷ್ಮೀಜಸ್ವಕ್ಷಸಿ ಜಸ್ಯಾಸ್ತೀದ ಸಂಬಿಹಿಂಗಮಹಂ ಭಜೆ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ ಹರಿ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರಿ ಹರಿ ಭಜೇ ಭಜೈ ಕಮಂಡನ 
समस्तपापखंडनम भजे वजे कमंडनम समस्त पाप खंडनम सभाक्त चीतरंजनम सदैव नंदनंदनम सदैव नंदनंदनम भजे वजे कमंडनम समस्त पाप खंडनम सभाक्त चीतरंजनम सदैव नंदनंदनम सदैव नंदनंदनम गौरी गोष्ठीपति शिशिल भक्ति सिद्धांत सरस्वती गोस्वामी ठाकुर भगवान परमंश जगदगुरु टोल दोज वर Gauriya devotees, in true sense, those who are Gauriya devotees, they are ne they never going to demand any pratishtha. Whatever they are doing, for that, they never expect any return. Gauriya Goshti Pati, Sri Sila Bhakti Siddhanta, Saraswati Goswami Jagat Bhopat, Paramahansa Jagat Guru told. those who are gauriya devotees in true sense they never demand any lap puja pratishtha maybe they have some special efficiency special efficiency they have they have some special education special efficiency but still for any seva they are doing they never want to get any return out of that on the contrary they always speaking that everything done by guru dev they going to attribute <coughs> they always they always like to attribute all the credit to the original point original point means simati radharani charan or if you are not up elevated up to that point nitananda prabhu so sila bhakti siddhanta saraswati goswami jagat bhopa paramahansa jagat guru told that maybe they have some special efficiency capacity but they never dip, deserve any credit for anything done special be it for preaching base collection of money whatever you see they never demand they say everything done by guru But I have done nothing. Done. This is the actual mood of a Gauriya devotee. Gauriya devotee less interested. I mean, amount of preaching done by Gauriya devotee, any amount of Siddhanta Bichar, any number of writing, any number, any seva. But they never personal. They never deserve any personal credit. They think everything done by Supreme. It is true. Actually, Papa speaking, all Gauriya devotees are true, pure Gauriya in true sense. They are going to attribute the whole power in the original point. From their power coming, so I have done. I have nothing to do. Why you are why you are going to going to praise me? I have nothing to do. All done by Guru Bhargu. This is the actual feeling of a Guru Bhargu. so we are going to follow them so we also like to develop that kind of mood vaishnavi pratishtha tate karo nishtha tahana korile rovira bhogo we are very much interested about vaishnavi pratishtha you all can give me honor but you don't know even a single pratishtha not going to touch my heart i know as it is i am because i know all pratishtha are uh, my gurudev kante my guru maharaj can think all pratishta he is going to pass on to me i have also no right to take it. i can pass on to popa popa can pass on to gorkishor baba this way all pratishta all credit going to the original point back that is called actually vishnu vipratishta if you are not going to 
take Vaishnavi Pratishta, then surely you can fall down, today or tomorrow. Also, you can fall down if you are going to deserve all credit. I have done preaching. What you have done? Nothing done by you. That is also fall down. This is the condition. We always singing this song, but we never understand the meaning. Jaya Rupa Sanatana Vattu Raghunath, Sri Jiva Gopal Vattu Das Raghunath, E Chhoi Gosai Jave Braja Koila Vahas, Radha Krishna Nitwali La Karila. This we cannot realize. Vindavan as it is okay, but Vindavan, you know, in front of our eyes materialize, like to put one carton in front of you, so that we cannot see. By the mercy of Gauranga Mahaprabhu, I mean, by the kripa of Gauranga Mahaprabhu, all our Goswamis, they, we are singing in the Kirtan that this six Goswami, their Charan Renu, is a six handful of prasadam for us. You don't understand. Tasavar Padarenu Mor Panchagras. You don't understand. You go to the Kirtan. Tasabar Padarenu, their food does, is our all, you know, handful of prasadam for us, all in India. People cannot understand. People cannot understand what do you mean. Tasabar Padarenu, more panchagras, their food, their, their Dust particle from their lotus feet each hour prasadam. You don't understand what the meaning. Panchograsmani, we can take and give prasadam. Panchogras, five different handful of prasadam. People putting question, what do you mean, Maharaj? Where food, dust particle from the lotus feet of Goswami is, is our uh, uh, no, panchograss. Five handful of prasadam for us. What do you mean? Meaning is very secret. It doesn't mean you are going to take all you know, rice, chapati, dal, not that. It means all our sense organ going to demand something. All our sense organ, our eyes, our ear, our nose, our tongue, all going to demand something. So you will have to supply something to them because they... But here, in Kirtan it is written that all five sense or five zones, there is division. And a Karmendriya, Gyanendriya. Now we are speaking about Gyanendriya. Karmendriya and are speaking. So five, karm five Gyanendriya, eyes, by eyes, Always like to see the beauty of the dust particle from the lotus feet of six Goswamis. All of you see. My eyes always want to see the beauties of the lotus dust particle from the lotus feet of six Goswamis. Chai Gosai. My ear always like to hear the glories of the dust particle from the lotus feet of Goswamis. Like I told many times about the glories of the dust particle from Rupa Goswami Pata The day we can, the day we can see the beauty of the, you know, of the dust particle from the lotus feet of Rupa Goswami Pata, the day we can discover, the day, that same day, we can discover how ugly my heart is. How ugly. And under the guidance of Rupa Goswami, by His mercy, I can also, I can also decorate my heart. I can also decorate my heart so that Krishna become interested to see me. So beautiful lady, I like to be. Saru. This way, my tongue always try to get the water was Charnamitha. Hello. This way you see all my ear, eyes, 
tongue, all, eh? all intellect, everything, all sense organ, all like to take the dust particle from the lotus feet of six Goswamis. It is my, I can take dust particle, take on head, take on heart, all everything. This way, tasavar padarenu mor pancho grass. Anyway, it is far away. First of all, I was speaking about one very vital point that whatever you are doing, finally you should get the extract in the form of knowledge, experience, knowledge. Varnasam Dharma is applicable for all. Those who are going to follow Varnasam Dharma system. Because if somebody is going to jump, ignoring Varnasam Dharma, he cannot get anything. Those who are very lucky, very lucky, very lucky Jivatma, those who are doing bhajan, going to reach up to the stage of Paramahansa, then no use of Varnasam Dharma. Now Varnasam Dharma no utility. What do you do? He's gone up. His consciousness, his, you know, his consciousness gone beyond the limit of the material world. When your consciousness, when your consciousness is going to leave the limit of this material world, in that case no need. Otherwise, so long as you have some or other kind of bondage, you will have to follow Varnasam Dharma. And you have no right to snatch the right of other people. He is doing according to his condition, according to stage. Chaturvarna Maya system Gunakarma Vivagasaha. Bhagavan told to categorize, to categorize the whole you know, society. I was bound to make some segregation. So that the system can be very pure, scientific. Because maybe according to previous sanskar, you are Brahman. But you are going to do some leather job, leather, leather. Then, maybe according to your previous sanskar, you are Khatriya, but you are going to do some service of Sudra. Or a Brahman going to do service of Sudra. Cleaning bathroom, this, that, washing your leg, and cleaning everything. In this way, no. In this way, our society can never go up to certain level. Never go. Because all system broken. All system broken. All Shudra, you know, very low caste going to sit in the high asan, a minister. Low caste, no idea, no knowledge, nothing. Whereas, whereas, it is it is a right Siddhanta that all political leaders, all king, all political leader, they should be a by very nice philosopher. All political leader, king, minister, all they should be a very number one philosopher. Philosopher doesn't mean if he, they are Bhagavad Dharma philosophy. If they know this, then hundred percent perfect. I cannot go up to that far. I cannot expect. They, they are actually like beasts. So at least if they have some darshan, fine darshan, at least they have morality, restriction, character, still it's okay. I cannot speak up to Bhagavad Dharma. Because Bhagavad Dharma was there with Bhagavad Dharma was there with Parikhid Maharaj. Bhagavad Dharma was there with Ambarish Maharaj. Bhagavad Dharma was there with Prithu Maharaj. That's why you can see huge success. I cannot go up to that point. I like to say all ministers, king, everybody, they should be a nice, good philosopher. I mean, at least they can see something. Future, this, that, what to do, what will happen, what is my condition, I should not do it. All this kind of philosophy. Otherwise, they are like beasts. 
So Bhagavan wanted to segregate this society into four parts, Brahman, Kshatriya, Vaishya, Shudra. And now everything broken. Nobody going to follow anything. One Shudra going to marry one you know, Brahman girl, this, that, all problem, finish. No genetical factor is pure, all contamination. All contamination. So what I mean to say, so long as you are not going to cut this material bondage, so long as you are not going to reach the level beyond this material world, material limit, you will have to follow Varnasam Dharma. And in course of your Varnasam Dharma, why you are following Varnasam Dharma, what is the utility, how you can follow, you shall know. Then finally, you can grow some knowledge. In course of following Varnasam Dharma, Today or tomorrow. That's why Bhagavan told in Gita that Sreyano Sreyano Biguno Paradharma, I Sreyano Biguno Sadharma Paradharma Bhayavaha. It is far better to follow your own track according to your own sanskar, better you can follow. Don't try to jump. If you jump, you can lose your previous sanskar, I mean habit, and you cannot catch it because it's too high. So in between you can get finished. That Jivatma cannot get benefit. Sriyanu Sadharma, eh? Sadharma is far better than Sriyanu Sadharma. Sayano Biguno Sadharma Paradharma Bhaya Bhaya Bha Paradharma Bhaya Bha fearful you can get destroyed. So Bhagavan wanted to you know, make some system. Now I was speaking about how you can get some final conclusion. Final conclusion, whatever you are doing. If you are doing random way, no system, nothing. Like crazy, it's a. But if you are going to follow some system, you are bound to think about what you have done previously. Because what you have done, why done? What is the outcome? You should realize. Bhakti Thakur, same thing, wanted to say that the commentary of that Gita, of that, you know, Sayanu Sadharma Paradharma Bhayavho. This is okay. So, Bhagavan, our Bhaktivinoda Thakur wanted to indicate that whatever you are doing, Drabhama Yoga, matter Yoga, all Yoga oriented to matter. All Yoga oriented to matter, like Harikatha, Kirtan, Prasadam, you are doing. Harikatha, Kirtan, if pure devotee doing, it is not matter. Material yoga, it is fine yoga. But what I mean to say, all different kind of worship, distribution of clothes, or food, this prasadam, this everything. Else. But if you are not going to think what is the net outcome, final outcome, what is the final? You are going to make some spiritual development out of that or not? That is the main thing. If you are not going to think that way, then you cannot make any progress. So, finally, you will have to think about what is the net outcome. Sayano Dubbrama Yogya, Jnana Yogya Parantapaha, because Sarvana Karmana Khilam, Jnana Parishamatpat. All what you are doing with some purpose, finally you can realize the sedimentation, I mean the final outcome, in the form of some extract, in the form of knowledge. If not so, then you are crazy, like beast. Now I can give one example. I can give one example by the help of which you can realize this point. Otherwise, if I go on speaking so many tattva siddhanta, you can realize or cannot realize. As a some doubt. There was one, there was one Brahman, very nice Brahman in one place. 
he was businessman he was not doing any puja nothing one brahman anyway he was doing business actually and in business he was making huge profit anyway but money too much attachment for money he is going to make profit but not going to spend even a single penny for some good purpose donation for is a leave it donation not even a single price but about family members you should spend something but family member about family member he was so you know so close fist man a very he don't want to spend money for even for family member finally family family members they become angry because he is earning money is not spending for family for why he is earning finally those family members gradually become very angry upset somehow they are, you know so what happens one day one day actually king going to send messenger some team to search all his property and due tax everything and if at all done some mistake for that penalty all together a big amount of money king going to send one team investigation investigation party so king going to send and going to search or all going to take so much money and property and give to king this way huge amount of property taken by king after that what happens is reading is normal life some day one group of dockers dockers you know dockers was going to cut and feed they attack the building and take all ornaments whatever money and deposit time and all jewels everything all taken away even some amount of cash was there in his box that was also taken all everything taken anyway he was in trouble because king took everything now also big problem when everything all money property everything gone now the family member getting one chance getting one chance then he they started insulting him because he never spent money for family properly so now they are getting chance they are going to kick him out they go out useless useless you go out they throw him out kick him out he is going outside now nothing with me where to go how to go business all finish money all gone all labor everything they used to they all gone to their home because who can no money nothing then the man he is thinking very with full anxiousness thinking with full anxiousness where to go how to go what is my condition why this kind of situation arrived in my life suddenly he is you know going to think well maybe it is that maybe it is the blessing of bhagwan why i am going to take negative way why i am going to take negative way i should take it positive way nunam bhagwan santushto very happy with me nunam nischitam eva jeno eno dasanitam so that i am already put in this condition maybe it is a blessing then that you know that brahman he was uh, giving consolation to himself because he is getting some support of tatagya now automatically he was thinking whole life my six my age is 60 over brahman thinking now my age is almost 60 over 60 over man almost i am going to die right from my birth up to 60 years old 60 years over what i have done in my whole life all eating and sleeping nothing done 
I have none, nothing auspicious activity, not chanting Harinam, nothing. All. Nunam Bhagavan Santushto Bhagavan Harihi. Nishchit, I am sure that today Bhagavan is very satisfied with me. That's why Bhagavan is going to arrange this kind of helpless situation in my life so that I can discover that when my support is only Bhagavan, nobody else. No wife, no children, no friend, nothing. He is now going to grow knowledge. He took decision to take sannyas. He took decision to take sannyas. He took, you know, mantra, anything some, from some guru and took sannyas and treated on the sannyas by body, speech and mind. He took decision to follow Triranda. He is going to give punishment to his speech. He is going to give punishment to his body. He is going to give punishment. Kai man, mind. How successful he was. How successful he was. Guru Padma used to speak this thing to me sometime to help me grow my Enduring power, so that I can tolerate everybody insulting, this thing, all is going to insult. So this way Guru Patan used to teach, you see. You should remember that the, that, the his, that, the case, that the history of that Brahman, you should remember. That Brahman took sannyas, he is now free of any tension. Because if there is at all head, then the question of headache. I have no head, no headache. If there is head, now you have head, that's why headache. If there is no head, no question of headache. So he is now free. He is going to sleep very nicely on the ground, very nicely, someplace. He is going to, you know, collect some bhiksha, madhukuri, but not speaking anything. With the pot he is going, if somebody giving something, okay. If not giving, not giving. Whatever he is going to collect whole day, then around three o'clock, he is going to reach one riverside place where he used to collect all dry leaf, everything, and make a fire, going to cook that thing. After that, he is going to put Tulsi and offer to Bhagavan. Today I arrange only this thing. Even not potato, only some rice. Oh, this you take. Is going to offer to Bhagavan with Tulsi. Follow. Whatever he get. After that, he is going with full tolerance. Even maybe without salt. Who can give salt? He is going to take to salt. Prasadam. Very satisfied. It is the arrangement of Bhagavan. Otherwise, why this kind of situation uh, he can meet with? So sometimes it happens so, he has one common dole, common dole, you know, common dole, water pot. Somebody taking water pot away. Somebody taking the dunder from here, yeah? kapat, kapat, kapat. Kapat is kapat, take dunder and going up. But still he is not speaking. Still he is not speaking. They force him, they force him to speak something. They force him to develop their, his fighting mood. They are forcing outside world, forcing him to develop fighting mood. What is not fighting? Or oh, one tanda taken away, common rule taken away, and not giving, laughing. Yes, kapat, kapat. This way they do. Somebody going to spit on his body. Somebody, somebody going to you know do something, so many things. This way, he become an object of game. He become an object of game. Everybody playing with him. Even when after whole day, when he is a full patience, going to make something and going to offer Bhagavan and going to take prasadam, some young you know some. Wicked boy coming and making urine on his on his pot. 
He is living prasadam. Cannot take. Because they are wicked boy. So this way, somebody is beating on him, somebody is throwing stone on him, useless copper. Eh? Scopper this way. But the man with full patience, not going to give any answer. Even our Gorkisar Bhavajima. Some small boy used to throw stone to him. Bhavajima is not speaking. Somebody is speaking rubbish to him. Bhavajima is not speaking. Somebody giving dust to his body. Bhavajima is not speaking. Only, only speaking, well, I can go to Jasudama and complain. His darshan, you know, he is in Vrindavan now all the time. You going to say, well, I can go to Jasodama and complain that you are, you know, putting me in trouble. This much. Nothing. No fighting. Nothing. So up to this stage, who can go? That is the main problem. Who can reach up to that point beyond body limit, who is woman, who is man, what is my property? Well, up to this point, who can reach? Many times Prabhupada used to say, many times Prabhupada used to say, so long as I have some attachment, so long as I have some attachment for anything, till then I cannot do any pure harina. If I have constant attachment with my own body, and body related thing, Popa thing many times told. So long as we are going to, you are, so long as we have attachment for your our own body or body related thing, till then we can never do hari, perfect harina. Pure harina we cannot do. And if at all there is no pure harina, then how we can, I can go? First of all, I have to take shelter of harina, na? Harinam is the best thing, topmost thing. Without taking shelter of Harinam, I cannot go there. It's a big problem. So try to remember, I give the example, and now I can show you how six Goswamis or other lateral all Goswamis like, you know, how they are doing bhajan. How possible? How it is possible they are doing this kind of bhajan. Even in dream it is impossible for us. Shankha purvaka nam gananati bhi kala vasahi kito nidrahar bihar kadi vijito chatanta dino chajo. Aha. No question of prasadam, no question of sleeping, nothing. Almost whole day dancing, singing, writing. Oh my God, how? Sankha Purvaka Nama Gana Nati Bhi. All 24 hours, how they are going to engage themselves in Seva. Miracle. Miracle. Yes. We cannot believe. Each and every day, they are going to take shelter under a new tree. Not even, this tree is very good. Very dense, I can stay here. Not that. Each and every day they are going to change the place because I can develop affinity. This tree is very good. Shadow is there, I can feel comfortable. Not that. Not that. How? No question of what to eat, how to eat, where from we can collect, nothing. Somehow Bhagavan is going to arrange, they are going to manage their life. This way we see, we are ever grateful to Sargoswami, infinity period. We can never pay them, whatever they have done for us. Anyway, I was speaking about how Gopal Bhattu Goswami was successful to, man, you know, to discover other. Because out of, the, out of extreme love, out of extreme love of Gopal Bhattu Goswami, Radharaman was bound to manifest this way. This Radharaman becomes so nice, one cannot even imagine how nice Radharaman became. So Gopal Bhattu Goswami was very happy. He started serving 
in different mood. Gopal Bhatta Goswami is usually not going here and not going usually. Not going, usually. Sometime going to Gurudev and Kamban, sometime, sometime going to do bhajan in Sanket, one place in between, I already told, in between Nandagram and Barsana. From Barsana, if you start, then you can meet Prem Saravat. I can come to this point. What is the glories of Prem Saravat? Prem Sarva you can meet. After some time, you can go to that spot, I mean place, it's called Sankhya, where Krishna Bhagavan used to play on the fruits to give indication to Radharani, I already reached. That is called Sankhya is actually Sanskrit name, and Bengali also we say. So Sankhya actually indication. Sankhya means actually English indication. That's giving in it. That is the best place. There Gopal Bhattu Goswami sometime, he used to go there, and do bhajan. Many times I went to his bhajan, could he this, there, anywhere. This way, now I can come to the point of now, one by one. Now, I am speaking all in gist, not in details. So, Radharaman was discovered uh, in the Vaishaki Purnima, I think so. Vaishak mass. Now I can come to the point of, you know, this Bihari. In Vrindavan, Banke Bihari is very important. Many all over the world, everybody knows. Because anyway, Goswami, all Goswami, they discovered deity, Radha Govinda, Radha Govinda, all this. But anyway, this deity is gone out of, externally, externally, has gone to some Chaipur, uh, Sinaji Sina gone to Nathodwar in Gujarat, one long distance, very long distance from Jaipur, one night journey. From Jaipur, one night journey, you can go long way. Finally, in the morning time, you can reach, reach uh, Nathodwar. There go. This way, almost all deities, important deities, were transferred to either in Jaipur or in Karoli or Mathoda, this way all gone. Anyway, but still, in place of those deities, those, you know, those, you know, pure devotees, they arrange deity. They arrange like Radha Govinduji gone, but they install Radha Govindu, because temple is same. Original Radha Govindu may be gone to Jaipur, but they install another Radha Govindu. It's all same. It was installed by Goswamis, I mean, Later on, maybe not six Goswami, after that those Goswami they install. So we are going to give same honor to them. But the time I am speaking about, they are just all date is gone. So somebody has to think what to do, what not to do, make tempo, Govindaji gone, so we have to install Govindaji. That was that. By that time there was some vacancy in between. After that it happened so. So, what to speak about that, you know, Banke Bihari. Banke Bihari, very famous all, whole world. Banke Bihari, there is some history. Who discovered, who discovered this Banke Bihari? You know the name? You know name? Actually, name is Haridas Thakur. Not that Haridas. Not our Haridas. His name is also Haridas Thakur. Banke Bihari, Banke Bihari was discovered. Banke Bihari was discovered by Haridas Thakur from Niduban Forest. That time, that time Niduban Forest was vast, big thing. Now they make one wall. This that, that time no wall. That time there was no wall. So. He was a very nice sadhu, but he was not from our Gauriya Sampadaya, he was from Nimbark Sampadaya. Very nice sadhu. Totally detached man like Goswamis. He used to take whatever getting, this way he didn't like. And his main bhajan was song. He was, a, he was such a nice singer that you can go mad. When he is singing some song, like all the environment changing, so nice, deep feeling of song. Also, I forget, I forgot to tell you 
that Rupa Sanatan, they used to hear Bhagavad Katha from whom? Raghunath Bhattu Goswami. He is the son of, I told already, the Tapan Misra from Baranas. Originally, he was not from Baranas, he was from our East Bengal. But anyway, by the order of Mahaprabhu, you go to Baranasi, you stay, someday I can meet you. Why Mahaprabhu speaking? There is some Leela. So he was the son of, he, has a, he, has, he is the son of Tapan Misra. I was so lucky at the time of Gauranga Mahaprabhu's visit there, he was successful to serve the lotus feet of Gauranga. So lucky. He was successful to get Uchista, which is even rare for Brahma Sankar. That he got. And while Mahaprabhu uh, taking permission to go to and come back to Bangla, I'm going now, everything. In that case, Mahaprabhu told, don't arrange marriage for this boy. Let him take education because Varanasi is a, such a place where all different kind of education was available. Baranasi was such a place where all different kind of education was available. Now, little bit, little bit now is contaminated by Mayavadi, totally. But very, very high class Pandit, they used to stay there. All their duty is only education, giving lesson, learning, giving lesson, learning. Like Navadi. Thousands of Pandit, you go to Chaitanya Bhagavad, Countless Pandit, each and everybody, every room, they are all big, big Pandit. All their duty is to teach and learn. Whole day. It's, you can go to Chaitanya Bhagavad. Binda on the writing. Whole day. They are nice. Oh, what not? All logic, you know, all Vedanta, Ved, oh, Upanishad, what not? <coughs> this way, all busy with education. Navadip was so important that even you cannot imagine. Anybody, anybody going to take certificate from anywhere, anywhere in the whole world. Whole world, I say whole world. But actually in India it is a land of knowledge, na? so India anywhere they can go. Whole world I can convince is not wrong. If you search whole world, you know, where you can get funding. It's right. So if somebody going to if somebody going to get some certificate, any part like Mithila, Mithila is the birthplace of Sita Devi. If somebody going, Mithila was very, very high class place. All educated people. All so Tarka logic, very, very big pandit. But finally, if somebody is not going to collect certificate from Navadip, they are not so important. They can collect certificate from anywhere, any follow, any place. But finally, if they are not going to take certificate from Navadi, then they are not so important. So, so this was a very important place. Somebody is speaking now at present, those are speaking. Navadi was the export of India. But I would say just Navadip was the export of India, but I can say they are wrong. Oxford is a Navadip of Oxford is. A, they are speaking wrong. How we can uh, compare Oxford with Navadip? Navadip is transcendent. They are speaking like that. That Navadip was the ancient export of India, but not that. We can say just opposite. Anyway, so what I mean to say, Tapan Misro wanted to give education to the boy, because Baranasi anyway, very nice place. Jiva Goswami Bhatt also took education from Navadip, Madhusudan Saraswati. But that doesn't mean <laughs> Jiva Goswami is going to get lessons, so he is not eternally present. They are doing manifesting this kind of lila. Bhakti Minut Thakur is going to take lesson from Vidya Sagar. That doesn't mean Vidya Sagar is a teach as a guru of Bhakti Minut Thakur. Rather, I would say, Bhakti Thakur is a guru of, you know, who is a guru? 
Mahaprabhu took sannyas from Kesab Bharati. But actually, Mahaprabhu is the guru of Kesab Bharati. Mahaprabhu is going to speak the mantra. You, you, you see, in dream, I got this mantra. Is that, is that mantra you are going to give me? So he is going to give mantra. So who give mantra to whom? Kesab Bharati is going to give mantra to Mahaprabhu or Mahaprabhu is going to give mantra to Kesab Bharati? That is the main question. So a foolish world, they don't understand. So this way we see, Varanasi is a very important place. That time, all different kind of knowledge was available there. Vedanta, Upanishad, Puran, Bhagavatam, all. If, if you like to get education, you will have to go to Bharanasi. That time, what I am speaking. So anyway, Jiva Goswami Pad, gone to Baranasi and there he took an education there and the teacher, I mean Guru Madhusan Saraswati was surprised to see the, see the fine brain of this boy. That man was a disciple of Sarvam Vartajaju. Previously, Sarvam Vartajaju was Mayabadi. He was converted, you know already. And this way, that, that Madhusan Saraswati is a disciple of, he was also converted by that time, by the magic spell of Mahaprabhu. Now they are not Mayavadi. Now Sarvamurti Jaja is not Mayavadi. Prakasananda, you know, that, you know, Prakasananda also I told, he also converted. He started dancing and singing. He could realize the glories of Harinam. And now Jiva Goswami Pada also took lesson. Anyway, so the son of Tap Tapan Miso, he was already in Varanasi. So there is no shortage of education. So he learned everything. And after that, father and mother gone from this world and leave and come and join Saragoswami. I mean, five Goswami is already there. But his recitation was so nice. His voice was so nice, he written in Chaitanya Chaitanya. One Bhagavata Sloka, one Bhagavata Sloka, he used to speak all six or seven, six or seven different tone, tone, voice. And everybody can feel like magnet. So Rupa Goswami Bhat, Sanatana Goswami Bhat, they used to sit very, with closing eyes and hearing all Bhagavata Katha, spoken by Gopal Vattu Goswami. Aye. Raghunath Das Goswami Goswami. It is written. His voice was so nice. So, I am speaking that Haridas Thakur Raghunath Bhatto Goswami. Gopal Bhatto Goswami already told something. Now I am speaking about Raghunath Bhatto. You, you see, na? Siru Jaya Rupa Sanatan Vatta Rugunan, Vatta Rugunan, Sijiva Gopal Vatta, Das Rugunan. First Rugunan is Gopal Vatta. Last Rugunan is Rugunan Das Gusan. You don't understand. Jaya Rupa Sanatan, Vatta Rugunan, that Vatta Rugunan. Jaya Rupa Sanatan, Vatta Rugunan. Sijiva Gopal Vatta, Das Rugunan. Das Rugunan, Rugunan Das. So it's okay. No problem. So anyway, that Banke Bihari was discovered by that great sadhu, Haridas Thakur. He is from Nimbark Sambadaya. He is a nice sadhu. His main bhajan was chanting Harinam and doing Kirtan. Morning, na evening he used to sing Kirtan. So nice, his tone was so nice. That even, ba, even birds in the trees, they used to stand and hear. So nice voice. So when, so the day when our Banka Bihari was discovered, he was, he gone mad. Sketching a lap, no place where to preach. He is in, staying in forest. No place where he can put, like Gopal Bhattu no place where, like one basket, 
putting up. No place. That time Vandavan was almost in a forest. So he used to stay in such a place where it is not possible to serve. But still, somehow we're going to manage putting deity and somehow going to serve. And his serving is men, his serving is mainly song. Somehow is going to offer something, water and this, that, but most of the time singing. His singing was so sweet that, that Banki Bihari was very much interested to hear. Banki Bihari used to hear his kirtan so much. The deity is there, he is doing kirtan, very nice. Deity, Bhagavan become very happy, very happy, very happy. Now I can speak one incident by the help of by the help of which you can realize the gravity of his kirtan bhajan. I mean song bhajan. He had one disciple, his name is Tansen. Tansen. What name? T A N S A N. S A S E N. Tansen. T A N S E N. Tansen. His name. He was a Big singer. He was such a big singer that even the king of Delhi used to give him honor, used to count his name as a very important pandit, singer, art and so many, many kings. They used to arrange so many in the Sava assembly, in the assembly of Kim, like Bikramaditya. Like Vikramadito, not today, long ago. Vikramadito or many, many kings, they all used to collect some important personality from the society. Some expert about science and technology, that time. Some expert with art and culture. Some expert in song. This way, so many, some Brahman who is very expert in Jagja, everything. So it was their mood. They used to appoint so many people around. So that any problem going to happen relating to any matter, they can get some concern. It was the usual rule. So he was one of the main member of his group. Many member. Almost every day, King used to hear song, used to hear song. One day, King Akbar told that I like to meet with your Gurudev. You say your Gurudev is exalted devotee, great devotee. He discovered Bhagavan, so you cannot take me in front of me. No, well, I can try, but usually he is not meeting with a man. He is staying in lonely place. What to speak about king? No woman, no king, nothing. Only Bhagavan. And so I don't know, I cannot give guarantee. He can, I can allow you to meet with my Gurudev or not. I cannot give guarantee. But anyway, let us go. Then they are going, Agwar Vasa, very simple dress, very simple dress, very, very simple dress. Finally, very secretly. Then Tansan speaking, wait, let me see what Gurudev is busy with. Maybe some Baba, maybe who can say is now in Baba, cannot be, let me see. He watching Gurudev going to start one song for Bhagavan. He's doing a nice song. The Akbar Vasa speaking, now we cannot go because there is one kind of disturbance. Let him sing the song fast so we can hear. So, Batsa, I mean the king, and this, you know, Tansen, both of them waiting in a booth, in a booth, waiting, and hearing the, hearing the song. Oof! King gone mad. King like to go and jump into his lotus feet, but don't, don't do it. Gurudev can feel sorry, you know. He is going to hear. But the situation was not uh, suitable, so, Kagbar Bhatsa could not meet with his Gurudev because with the separate mood could not be come back. It's not successful. Only 
Only there's a you know the prophet that they could hear the song from the lotus mouth of this much. Very nice song. And the song is singing, there is nobody there, nobody there. Only Bankabiari is singing. Taking Bankabiari in the lap and going to sing the song. For the complete satisfaction of Bankabiari. Akbar Basa, when gone back to Delhi, after some day, he is requesting Thamsen. You are a great singer. You are a great singer. You can sing the song sung by your Gurudev. I like to hear again. Tansen to Tansen to 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 Tansen, King speaking. Could you please sing the same song sung by your Gurudev? I like to hear it. Very nice. Well, you give me order. I can try. Then Tansen started singing. Tansen was such a singer that if I am going to put one sto a stone chip in water, it can melt by singing. You cannot believe. You cannot believe. It is a fact. It is a fact that there is dry season. All the leaf of the tree is gone. Tansen started singing. Bashanta Rag. Then all new, new leaves and everything develop in the trees. But you cannot believe. You can think it is a story. You can go through history, 100%. Sometimes there is competition going on. Tansen not in challenging, challenging mood. Tansen never in challenging mood. Basa speaking, you can sing such a song that the stone can melt. Well, I can try by the mercy of Guru. He is singing and the stone melting. This is a fact. Sometimes this tree is pulled dry. Can you arrange your leaf and everything? Okay, let me see. Singing. Song is so high power, you cannot imagine. You cannot imagine. So, Agwar was singing. After sing, after song is over, for some time, the whole assembly closed their eyes and going to control their Baba. Song is over, but five, five minutes, seven minutes, cannot speak. Nobody is speaking. All closing eyes and taking the Baba. Try to digest the Baba. So nice song. And after that, king opened the eyes and going to, see, going to speak to Tansen. Tansen, excellent. Amazing, excellent, but not like your Gurudev. And Tansen is excellent, your song is so excellent, amazing, but not going to touch the quality of your Gurudev. That is a man. Then Tansen with folding as a folding hand speaking, Gurudev, I actually king, oh, Javana, my Gurudev is a great devotee. He is singing only for the satisfaction of Bhagavan. I am singing for your satisfaction. He was singing for the satisfaction of Bhagavan. And I am singing for your satisfaction. How the quality can be same? If I try to speak Harikatha for the satisfaction of Bhagavan, then the quality can go high level. If I am speaking for my satisfaction to collect money, garland, and never. If I cannot get lost in my Harikatha, if I cannot get lost in my Harikatha, I can remember nothing. That is called Harikatha. Otherwise, it is not Harikatha. So many times I told, I can come to the point, many times, Prabhupada used to have told, so long, we are going to have some attachment for our body and body-related thing. Till then, we cannot do actual Harinam, actual Vajra. So, Bhankabhiyari was discovered this way, excellent. After that, some rich man going to make some temple long after. Now, this, you know, Bhankabhiyari, everybody going to Bhankabhiyari because they have no information about Goswamis. 
Most of the people, they have no idea about who is Goswami, who... <laughs> so most of the people going there and uh, taking yoga or malai, everything, and taking darshan and go on, material people. We are not going there usually, sometimes going, because they are all material people. Most of the people, all material, they are busy with matter and body. I, I hate them. All useless. They're coming with the car, AC car, put the car there, ah, they become hungry, they take malai, ask him this, that, and see, the, oh, Banke Bihari, Lal Ki Jai. This is their Bindavan Darshan. And then again gone to lick that stool and urine. Again they are going. Just for two hours or one hour they enjoy here. After that again they are going to lick all stool and urine. This is their Bindavan Darshan. So how I can blame? So this way, I can discuss more tomorrow, the after tomorrow, I can go on discussing. So you should remember the glories of Vrindavan, you should remember, you should not forget the glories of Goswamis, you should not forget about Brajavasis and after all, Nanda Nandan Sri Krishna. Vajay Vajay Kamandanam Samastapapakhandanam Bhaje Vajay Karanjanam Samastapapakhandanam Shabhakta Chitaranjanam Sadaiva Nandanandanam Sadaiva Nandanandanam Manchakalpadavusikibhasana Pachitanam Pavanepavishnapyo